very welcome to this webinar about event management on Podio. Uh, I will have a small Q&A session uh, after the webinar, so please just if you have questions either type them in the chat while we go along and I will answer them after uh, or we will uh, we'll take your questions afterwards. You will also of course get my Skype name. So event management. What I will do is share my screen. And I hope that everyone is seeing Podio right now. I am logged in with our uh, user David Thompson, who is a sales manager of this, uh, this webinar company. And he already manages a lot of his work on Podio, um, sort of CRM, development, internet, marketing, and so on and so forth. Um, and he decided that he wanted to have management of events on Podio as well. So, so that managing everything in one place would, would give him better control and overview of his working life. Um, and David went to the App Store, to the App Store and Podio where you can find apps for, for a lot of different, uh, different functions and sectors. Um, he looked at event management and he found the conference management pack. He then added that to his space called the seminars. So he renamed it a bit to call it seminars and he modified the apps a bit to suit his needs. Uh, that is a separate webinar and you will, uh, we could do that afterwards. So if we look at the different apps here, um, starting with the events app. So here we have two already created events that David has done. Um, we can look at the B2B branding seminar. Um, David Thompson is in charge, the budget is here, the webinars, uh, the, the venue, sorry, is here, small description of the event, and we have some related items as well. So these are the attendees that actually will attend this seminar, and these are the speakers that will uh, speak at the, the B2B seminar. What I will do now is I will make a new event, just to show you how that is, how that's being done. So the title is uh, Maxi. The date is next Friday. You can put who's in charge. Either it's Gustav Jonsson, who happens to be a part of this organization, or it's David Thompson. This time it's David Thompson who's in charge. The budget for this is 500 US dollars. The venue field searches through the venues app to see which venues are available for this. So we'll choose the Podio HQ, add a description. This is uh, an event station, some text here. Number of attendees turned up and that's of course after the event. We have images, could add files and create tags. You also see that now some auto tasks has been created. So a task for book a venue, book catering, write invitation email and book speakers. And those tasks come from modifying the app, scrolling down, looking at the tasks. And here you have book venue, book catering, write invitation email and book speakers. Continuing, I will be looking at the speakers app. So I'll record the potential speakers for our conference or seminar here. I'll select new speaker, name Gustav Jonsson, Jonsson at podium.com, phone number, choose from the events, website, area of expertise, and so on. You can of course also use a Podio web form to collect your speakers. So going to the front page of the speakers app, we have a public web form URL right here. So if I open this app, I'll get the web form um, that could be used on 
either embedding on a site or free freestanding like this. So it could be David Jones, David at Jones. Yo, SEO at SEO. About that. Gently close. Going back to Podio. And we'll see that David Jones has been added as a speaker by speakers via the web form. Of course, for every great event, you need some attendees, right? And the attendees are really the great way of using web forms. So I will look at my web form by going to settings and web form. And then I have some the, the web form creator right here, where I can uh, uh, edit my web form, make it look like I want it to, add a domain, so this cannot be misused by, by uh, any, any other sites. I have a shareable link right here. Could open that in a new tab. Sign up for Samar, similar link your contact is below, and select Samar. I'd like to turn it back to you shortly. I'll tell a person, Sweden, like me. Like to attend the sales seminar and the B2B branding seminar. Go into the attendees app. I'm showing all. I'll see that Pella Person is added 20 seconds ago by attendees via web form. Then, of course, if we look at this full item. You will see that an auto talk has been created here as well, delegated to David Thompson, that is me, um, that is logged in. So send email confirmation and I'll of course copy Pella's email address and when I'm done with sending this confirmation I'll just fill in this state field. Different seminars that Pella will be attending and I'll save it. And now you will also see on the events going to the sales seminar that Pella Person is among the attendees of this seminar. And the flexibility of, of Podio enables you of course to, to set up different types of events so it's like seminars like we have done today or maybe company events that are internal um, large conferences we do have a TED if you if you're familiar with TED conferences we have a TED pack in our app store built by a, a guy that, uh, that runs TED conferences on a regular basis so it, well, either you can have one space for um, a large conference or you do like we do now, we set up different events in one seminars or event management space as well, like we have done today. And that is the webinar about the event management on Podio. Um, hope you really enjoyed it. I enjoyed showing things to you. And uh, thanks a lot for that. <laughs>